It's a heavyweight showdown between Stipe Miocic and Francis Ngannou. So here is Francis Ngannou, perhaps the most frightening heavyweight on this roster, top to bottom at present. Very well-rounded fighter. He was born in Cameroon, where there's a big MMA scene. Now he's fighting out of Paris, France, and he really believes his UFC success could help expedite MMA legalization in France. He might be the champion by the time MMA is legal in France. This is one seriously tough customer in this UFC heavyweight division. This guy has devastating power to his kicking technique. Whether it's to the legs, the body, or the head, if one of those lands, you've got real problems. Representing Strong Style Fight Team in his native Ohio, here is the wrestler, boxer, and UFC heavyweight champion, Stipe Miocic, was an outstanding baseball player, but ultimately made the transition to mixed martial arts. We are certainly glad he did. Stipe Miocic, one of the all-time great heavyweights, trying to keep it going here tonight. This guy has one of the best abilities to take a shot that I have ever seen in all my years of commentating on fights. His chin is truly world class. And now our tail of the tape for this heavyweight fight. Four years, the difference in age between these two fighters with the same height and some differences in reach. Here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Herb Dean. is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas, it's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. It's a fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a boxer, holding a professional record of 11 wins, 2 losses. He stands 6 feet 4 inches tall, weighing in at 250 pounds. Fighting out of Paris, France, Francis, the Predator, and And now, introducing his opponent, fighting! This man is a wrestler, holding a professional record of 18 wins, 2 losses. He stands 6 feet 4 inches tall, weighing in at 240 pounds. Fighting out of Independence, Ohio, Stipe Miocic! You can give me your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves, let's make it official. This is a fight that we have been looking forward to for a long time and is about to take place right now. I'm very excited. Well, it is a venue that has hosted some of the biggest fights in combat sports history, and we are back for more, ready to go with live action underway here at the MGM Grand Golden Arena in Las Vegas. All right, we are ready to go for round one, and so is the heavyweight contender, Francis Ngannou. This is one of the faster starters, Joe, in this UFC heavyweight division. He's only gone the distance once in his entire pro career. The first round finishes have piled up. You can be sure he'll be looking to get the Muay Thai striking going early tonight. Ngannou, whoa! Man. He's got him hurt here. Oh, he's going for it here. Big body, body shot. shot there, too. Plants a nice one too. Oh! Vicious 
vicious combinations. That one hurt. right into that straight punch, Joe. Left the body wide open, and his opponent wisely took advantage. Let's see if he adjusts here moving forward. Was able to get that right hand over the top and to the target. And gone with oh! This could be it! Nasty combinations here. Hard straight punch. And Ganu gets in the clinch. Just over two minutes to go in round one. First takedown attempt is there. Lands the right hand. Excellent ground and pound here, not giving. Oh. And that's gonna do it. That's it. Wow. Wow. Man. To do that to such a durable guy and to do it with such composure the way he recognized he had him hurt relaxed kept his rhythm and just dropped bombs and then boom yeah joe that was some outstanding ground and pound to get the opponent out of there he was throwing big shots there on the ground man not just looking to score but actually looking to end the fight and to make sure the judges stayed firmly out of this equation. Elbows, punches, hammer fist, everything seemed to be working for him here tonight. Well, hard to perform much better than he did tonight. A huge knockout under the lights. They'll be talking about that one for some time. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called us off to this contest at three minutes, 16 seconds of the very first round. Defending the winner by knockout, Stipe Miocic. All right, so the heavyweight division remains Stipe Miocic's world after he retains the belt yet again here tonight. So from a Division I wrestler at Cleveland State University flirted with Major League Baseball, we are absolutely glad that Stipe settled on mixed martial arts. And now what he has done is to carve out one of the greatest heavyweight legacies this octagon has ever seen. Congratulations to strong-style fight teams, Stipe Miocic.